morning and night. Whoa. Hey, can you hear me, brother? Yes, sir. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. How are you? Sat Nam. Bienvenidos. Oh, yeah, man. I am only as good as you, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> All day. Yeah, man. Sorry, one second. No, no. Take your time. Take your time. Are you recording it now or do we have a second? No, yeah, we're we're good. We're good. Okay, cool. How did you yeah. how did you find me? I forget how we've um, been connected. No, absolutely. So, of course, um, big follower of Santos, one of my teachers. Oh, and yeah. I, yeah, and I came across your guys' video. You did like a two, three-part series. And this was like years, but I finally found you on Instagram. I didn't know you had an Instagram, and I've been following you, and I'm like, the things that you do, bro, to me is remarkable, and that's really what my platform is about, is just bringing people on to expand on their wisdom and their truth. So I was like, I got to have you on. Like, I think what you do is fascinating. That's awesome. Thank you, man. And I'm, I'm honored. All right. I'm just going to roll this little thingy up here. No, no, go ahead. Yeah. I'm going to do that too while we talk. <laughs> <laughs> How's everything going? <clears throat> you know, it's been crazy, dude. I mean, it's, I'll be real with you, man. I mean, please. You know, yeah. I, we keep it real. <laughs> same. I mean, and I love Santos, but there's some controversy with him too. And you know, I don't. Right. Like, right. You know, I don't gossip, but let's just say that we're not all walking the path like we're supposed to be. And um, I'm hearing from good sources that just, you know, people are saying one thing and then you hear them meet someone and then it turns into something else. And I'm like, yo, long story short, the truth is you also putting your personal stuff out there to encourage someone else that is awoke, but might still have some flaws. You know what I'm saying? Might have lust might still be eating animals if they are struggling, but we don't judge them. Right, so right, right. it's just been really nasty, but like judgment, you know what I'm saying? No, that's in, you know, it's cause like you said, at the end of the day, we're supposed to be examples and messengers. You know what I mean? So yeah. being in that, being in that position, you have yeah. to walk in, in as much light as you can because you have people who are like, you know, not saying anything or discrediting in Santa, but people are looking up to him. You know what I mean? Because he's like a voice of truth. Yeah. You know? That's why it's important for us to, uh, I guess, really always like the things that we're talking about. Is there a way to put a double screen? I think that I'm supposed to. I see your face, but not mine. Is it? Yeah, I don't see yours. I think you got to turn your camera on. Your on the bottom where it says video. Ah, there it is. <laughs> I'm I'm that vain. I'm very vain. I'm like, I have to see my face before I talk to you. <laughs> Yeah, and I don't like wearing this head. I don't like being constricted, but for some reason, my audio isn't working on the last podcast, so I've been having to yeah. use this. Yeah. So you're in Florida, huh? Yes, sir, in, in Orlando. Nice, man. I auditioned for the Orlando Ballet. Yeah, that's something I wanted you to talk about. Yeah, I know you've been a ballet artist, so. Oh, yeah, man. We'll break that down in a way that everyone can relate to it. Perfect. Yeah, and, I, and I've, that's one thing about me, like, I know people are walking in truth and this is just my truth that I know from source that people are walking in truth that something comes out of somebody that's so original that you know it's from source and yes. you have something original. You mm -hmm. understand what I'm saying? And this isn't mm -hmm. something that is on us. We just position ourselves to receive. So exactly. Just, you know what I mean? So I appreciate that, man. Yeah. I'm grateful that I'm able to see this kind of stuff. <laughs> Bro, I'm trying to, I don't have a big following, but every, if, I don't know if you watch my videos, maybe you don't. I don't have a big following, but the people that I bring, they're from all over the countries where I've like, I've heard them speak on something and they're doing something that is so original and unique that it needs to be shared because these are originalities. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like we're getting from the ether. Like the last individual I, I interviewed, he connected chrysanthemum, Christ, and vitamin C <laughs> to cure all, yeah, to cure all diseases. And so I had to interview that, you know what, I, this is the, this is what we need. I believe, well, not believe, but I know. I know this is what we need. Yes, sir. So this, no, well, what, uh, this is what I do. No, well, um, <laughs> is there a way to, uh, I'm not really good with technology. Is there a way to get this Zoom uploaded to my YouTube page? Like, how would I do that? Absolutely. What I'll do is once it's, once we're done recording, um, it'll convert and I'll send you the raw copy. And all you got to do is just go on your YouTube channel and click upload video. And Dope. it's, Dope. Or I can, it's pretty simple. So. 
I'm not good with technology either, but I know how to upload. So, <laughs> I know how to upload. first of all, it came from us. All of this stuff is our power, and it's just really funny how people can't see that. It's it's right in front of us. It's so one of my gifts is just being aware and being perceptive. Like I've always been like that all my life. You know what I mean? And when you're just yes. aware, it's right in front of you. You know what I mean? You just have to be still. Have to be still. It's true. You know. And then just and you are. Um, are you Spanish? Puerto Rican, or Boricua, yeah, Puerto Rican. Puerto Rico, the port of Re, of Ra, the sun. Yeah, it's uh, yeah, Rico, Puerto. It's the yep. It's exactly what it is. It's the people who know how to build things. This is why Latinos are always building our stuff. And me being a Capricorn, I'm a builder. <laughs> ah, that's right. Nice. <laughs> uh, oh, I got things for Capricorn, man. Uh, right. I'm big on astrology too. I love medical astrology even more, but I love is I love the language of the stars. I love these intelligences. And... I don't do the um the birth chart things because that can be kind of cerebral and too many numbers floating around. But I do uh, association with humans. And then, you know, you play with the word and you blow someone's mind with their name. If you decode someone's name or where they're from and play with it, they'll have an aha moment like you won't believe. And you right. just met them and you just met them, but you, you already knew them. Yeah, it's uh, like, like you're saying, like that's all etymology, like the answers are in the word. You know what I mean? So it's like me, since I study astrology so much, like my kids, to them now it's second nature. At first I used to freak them out, but we'll go out. I'll be in my own world. You know how it is. And I'm like, this person's a Scorpio. I'll be like, Hey, by the way, you're a Scorpio. How did you know? And I'm like, lucky. You know what I mean? So of course. just learning how to read energy and continuing yes, to sir. study and just, you know, putting it into practice basically. So I'm on, can I share this on my Facebook? Well, I'll just post the YouTube. Absolutely. Yeah. You can, uh, Oh, do you mean like a live? Yeah uh i yeah the only way you can do that is if we we're on facebook oh uh, yeah never mind but i'll like i said i'll give you the copy and you just download it on the facebook yeah i'll do that that'd be easier all right so like i said my podcast is pretty simple bro i don't have a script i go with the flow i'm the number nine it's all about flow so <laughs> <Nice>. <laughs> so it's uh i'll basically have a few questions that I've been wanting to ask you, but besides that, like, I just, I introduce you, tell a little bit about yourself, where you came from, and then just kind of get into whatever sources leading you to talk about. That's kind of how my podcast goes. So. Perfect. I'm cool. all about it. Yeah. There's no uh, restrictions. There's no right, syllabus. Totally, yeah. totally free. Cool. Yeah. Speak on whatever you want to speak about. So. I will do, man. There's a lot of things that need to be addressed. <laughs> no, absolutely. So let me do this. Um, how do you want me to address the viewers? Um, are you a numerologist? Like, what are some things you want me to throw out there so they know kind of what you do? Because another um, thing about this podcast, I want you to grow. Like, you have a yeah, service. Thank you. you know thank I mean? you. Very good point. Well, I'm many things, so I guess to keep it simple, just say light worker. Light worker. Okay. I know yeah. you're a lot of things. <laughs> But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to break down the word light worker because many of us don't know what it really means because some call themselves that. So I'm going to break that word down and just play with it with numbers and stuff too. Perfect. Let me just get my lighter and we'll start real quick, Luca. Nice, nice. <laughs> Good to go. It was in my pocket. <clears throat> <laughs> of course. Yeah, bro. This is something I've been playing with because I'm – I love to cook. So I'm always, that's one of my things is being creative in the kitchen with alkaline food. And I got this man, this little toy right here. It's a magnetizer. Wow. It's about 30 bucks. And all you do is because when you pour water, it's not, it's, it's living, but it's not structured. So when you put it on here for two minutes, it creates a vortex and it structures the water. Then what I do is I talk into it and then I drink it. <laughs> Game changer. <laughs> Game changer. That is genius. Yeah, that because is we just, that makes total sense. Yeah, sometimes we just take water or whatever we buy it from, like a jug or whatever, and we drink it and it's good. You know, it's it's alive, but it has conscious. But the thing about it is that it's not structured. Yeah. Just just like urine. Like it that's why when people drink age urine, it's structured so that your body can assimilate it. You see what it I makes mean? You it's, more, um, it makes you more fluid. Correct. Correct. Absolutely. 
Genius. All right, so we get this party started. I got this. We ready? And uh, yeah, brother, like I really first, like I said, I really appreciate you coming on and taking the time. I know I've been kind of hounding you on the side, but no, it's... not at all. Okay. Yeah, I'm not a I'm not a groupie or nothing like that, but I really, like I said, I really enjoy what you do, and it's really fascinating. And I think it just it, more people need to see it so they can understand a little bit more who they are. You know what I mean? So absolutely. So let me go All ahead set. and get this started here. Totally. And do you want to you want to just go by Rosin? You want to go by Jay? Like, does it matter, Jay? You can call me uh, Rosin. Yeah. Rosin. Okay. All right, so let me get this started. Sure. So ladies and gentlemen, brothers and sisters, welcome back to the New Rich New Energy podcast where we talk about truth and nothing but the truth. As you guys already know, have an amazing brother who's come on here to bless us with some amazing wisdom, some knowledge and some understanding and to kind of just break down some barriers so you guys can understand really what's going on behind the scenes. This brother's amazing. Not only is he into numerology, um, but he's into his own yoga ballet, which he's going to get into a little bit. He does a lot of creative things that are original that I had to have him on this podcast so he can share his truth. And I just want to welcome you, Satna Bienvenidos. How you doing, Rosin? Well, thank you. I'm going to say Om, Ah, Hum, Vajra, Guru, Padma, Siddhi for Buddha, for your mantra. So mantra to mantra. Uh, I'm nothing without my people. So thank you for allowing me to have this platform to show the awesomeness of, of us. So Whatever I say and do as an individual, I'm a light worker, light energy. Every human being has a solar plexus. Solar powered energy is in the gut instinct. Okay, gut is the same word as God. But a lot of people want to be atheists. I respect everyone's thing, right? But we have to be clear. The word God is the generator of vitamin D. It's a generation or it's the gene or the genesis of all of us. And we're complicated, but we're also very simple. So we're angels and demons. So what my numerology and what my light working is designed to do is to get you to see you within the truth that I'm seeing within myself, because division is the biggest problem. We'll keep it simple with religions. The biggest problem we know is division. We have division in the truth community, division with diet, division with your status, Division with, I'm a gangster, you make money, I do all this stuff. I smell good, you smell bad. So we go back to the anatomy and why numerology is all of us. So my solar plexus is in my gut, what is backed by my spine has 33 bones. The 33 bones of that spine are the antenna of that gut, of that light working. In which if your gut instinct is insecure, which we see fear today. We see impulse, right? Ego, I understand. You block your antenna. It's like the old school television. Remember the coat hanger? You adjust the TV to make that screen adjust. Your body is an antenna. So the 33 bones of that spine are the levels of light from your guts to your head. Now do the math with the rainbow. The first color is black. Everybody relates to black lives that matter. This is a game, yes, this is a division and a horrible division. I am every race. I look black, but my mom is as white as snow and calls herself only black, okay? So when we look at the pupil of my eye, it is black. The pupil is the student and the white circular colors are the Milky Way to debunk racism, to go back to my numbers now. The first color of that 33 ladder of my spine is black in which then it needs what? Blue? red, purple, and then something happens and then you and me are made, insects, air, a mountain, a blade of grass, a piece of wood, a thought, your syllables, where did it come from to even form a word? <laughs> so we go to the Bible, there's a book called Numbers, okay? Our days are numbered, they say. Why you should know numerology? Because the number associated with anyone's birth name We'll, we'll show you how you relate to certain time periods, the birth of something, a historical event that is about you getting out of your amnesia. Does that make sense? Perfectly good sense. 
Amnesia would just be simply this. I know where problems really good. I can do one plus one. I know if Jimmy had three apples, I know Einstein's theory. I'm a NASA person. I know the rocket stuff. That's not what I'm talking about. Those are the, let's just say, um, the four, four element intellectuals. They forgot ether. In which your Einstein, he damned the fifth element ethernet. Another number of people, five. Simple, we have a head, we have two arms, and we have two legs. That is a pentagram or a pentagon, yes or no? Right? Now, when I go to my parking meter, or my prime minister, the PM, Paul McCartney, it's patterns. It's a number to time, right? It is the quarter with a two and a five, 25 cents is seven though. I slow down. We are numerically physically aligned with the light system of the solar powered sun and its degrees over the earth in which we have a, an entity on earth. We call them the Illuminati, all right? They're also our twin though. Got to be careful. We relate to the demons, people. So only going after one thing will get you either killed, frustrated, or divided. This makes sense? Yeah. So as I'm speaking, I'm putting you and me and your viewers in this. So review it again. Solar plexus in my stomach. Spine has 33 bones. Your Christ Jesus died at what age? 33. Now your three and your three is your what? Six. Mm -hmm. Okay, Jay, slow it down. I don't understand you. I understand that. We have carbon 12. Why didn't Einstein tell us that? NASA, the professor, the preacher, the guru, the sifu. You see where I'm going here? In every time period, the human being has been so ignorant, but so powerful. And the biggest problem is that ignorance and missing the number and the patterns and how you are the power and you are the one that has to look at all the death and all the sacrifice of your ancestors over what? Simply repressing your education of your numerology, of your light. You built the pyramid. You built that castle. You built the stupa for Buddha. You and me did this. Today would be Pedro, Jimmy, maybe Rebecca. Back in the day, it was something different than names, yes or no? So if you ever want to, if you want to chime into what I'm saying, I don't want to hog the mic. You let me know. No, I'm, I'm letting you flow with it. We got right into it. So beautiful. No, do your thing. Carbon this is your 12? platform. Yeah, carbon twelve is your six protons, your six electrons. You should elect yourself, and your six. Did you Johnny Neutron? Neutron. So we have six, six, six in our DNA. Now I slow it down and go to Michael Jackson. A, B, C, easy gets one, two, three. The Trimurti of India, the Trinity. Is it pop music? Or is it someone trying to spin some numbers around like your parking meter? Yeah. Or your social, hear me, security number? So they're telling you and me that we're insecure, aren't they? We need to have a number, <laughs> right? <laughs> <clears throat> and then we have the lottery. You Catholics and Christians who damn gambling, of course, but they all gamble and go to church on Sunday and eat McDonald's. The lottery has Salem's lot, lot, L-O-T. <laughs> there are biblical verses in everything that we're dealing with. Fast food. We know fasting is a sacred thing. How did it become poisonous? So I go back to now, the body, numerology, why it's important to understand Freemasonry and secret people who knew 33rd degree Freemasonry. One of the highest numbers is your spine. And they didn't tell you and me this? The high ram of Biff, whoever they're, the Pharaoh, they said, shut up. Give me your wife. Give me your kids. Give me your taxes. Give me all the stuff you built. I'm not going to tell you. You have a solar plexus. First of all, the sun. You are the sun Ra. And you're important. So these numbers force someone to unify and they have nowhere to go, which is why my truth is kind of uncomfortable for a lot of people. They are used to debunking. I, I understand being right, being aggressive, <laughs> but not being conscious of the magical world that these numbers build us. So now I go back to my body. So I have 33 bones in my spine. Now, hmm, 
I have 12. Hear me, people. This is you are the apostles. I have 12 cranial nerves in my skull. Fact. Look it up. Everything I say, people, look it up for yourself and your children and your animals and all life on earth and your ancestors. They didn't know this stuff. They saw a painting or a statue of someone known as Shiva or Vishnu. Great. Apollo. Great. Um, Muhammad, whatever, right? Jesus, these statues. But the preacher, once again, back to the, the guru, I'm not damning all of them now. They seem to skip out on a vital piece of information that could have turned that student right away into their own guru, right away. Because we don't have time to be following anybody because we're dying. Yeah, my God's better than your God. My astrology better than yours. I'm vegan, you're a meat eater. I'm a ball earther, you're a flat earther. People, earth is simply the cube in geometry. You can use numbers to help people see the earth, honeys. <laughs> Ask them why, I don't even, you know what I'm saying? I'm being real. I don't even know why, but that's a fact. It is not a ball in the five platonic geometric solids. Now that took me how many minutes to just say all that simple stuff with no theory. If we go to school, brother, right? We go to school now. You and I are talking that, you know, that deep stuff. And what will they do to you and me while eating Subway and McDonald's and corporate cigarettes and Viagra and all of this stuff and that stuff? What will they do to you? They will, they will debunk you. They will be like, oh, oh, a lot of breathing, but they don't look it up. Now you have the power. You want to know why? Because they're used to researching. They're used to talking about, oh, I know this, that, that time period and that name with that. But you and me now are putting our numbers in there and giving them something that they didn't have which takes away their real power, not physical power. We will not win with physical strength and force. We win with the proper wisdom of our divine numbers and the astrology associated with our body parts. So now we have carbon 12, 666, that's the 12 apostles. We have 12 body functions. Jay, slow it down. Two and one is your three. How many times you got two timed by somebody? Are they two timing you? Simple, three stooges. Right? Brahma, Vishnu, Shiva. You must know someone is playing with your follow the bouncing ball. Ding, ding. Every time it bounced, it hit a letter. That letter has a number. A, B, C, one, two, and three now. So now I go to this. I have a bicep. What does bi mean? Two. I have a tricep. What does tri mean? Three. Very simple. If I'm a guru and I mention the Trimurti and Brahma, but I don't mention your arm, this is why we're divided. This is why we are weak, low self-esteem. Because the guru is great at telling you the stories and metaphors of making your life better, but they don't jump to your body first and get you to see that you're unique because control or remote control people and birth control, you must ask yourselves, I don't judge you, why is it controlling? Shouldn't it be free? Oh, here's the television. I'm just going to freestyle and push a button. No, you have to control the birth. Now, your condoms, spermicide is nanoxanil 9. Why isn't it 3.0? Nanoxanil 9 is the spermicide that I would use back in the day when I was sleeping to kill my sperm. Go to your soda, yellow number five. What is it yellow for? Fact. That's why you got to know your numbers, boo-boo. Every time we die, it's a certain age. Well, what how old was he? At what time did he die or she? You want to know why? So you can record that moment, add those numbers together, see what star system they relate to, to understand who was talking to you. It was not a body. It never was and never will. It's an illusion. A beautiful one, which, back to your truth movement, is it a man? Is it a woman? Is it gay? Is it straight? That one's Illuminati. That's a pedophile. People, that's not working. Okay? It's great that we can see the bullshit. Now, what makes you and me better to rise up from all that bullcrap? The wisdom of your astrology. Now, hippocampus in etymology it means Neptune's chariot. If anyone goes to my Instagram, Razen617, or to my YouTube, R-A-W space Z-E-N, my real name is J-H-E-J, -E 
I am showing you my birth name numbers relate to time periods of Buddhas being born, the area size of Kurukshetra, India, the land of the Mahabharata, my numbers are there, the district of that place. Every time I go to my phone, the numbers and the links are taking me to my name, dude. In numerology, what means this? What is a past life? A past life is your LP, past life, PL, the album. Where did they get us? They call colonist, colon, cholera, people, mira. The Mayans told me in Belize how they died. It was not the mud flood, apparently. Cholera killed them. Who did that? You see where I'm going here? Demons that know your numbers, right? They know how much formula to put in on the numbers to make that cholera to go the other way and make what? Poison, because mother nature is good and evil. Mother nature don't pick sides. She will work with Satanists, with light workers like me, mm -hmm. people like me and my padre here. And they work with animals, simple. They do it in a different way there. It's a little, it's not as conscious as we are, but now I'm rethinking human beings. We are now looking very conscious, are we lately, brother? Not at all. The TV is everything. The TV told me. Netflix, the special effects, Google. Star Wars. Yeah, anything but you. When you go to Star Wars and watch a movie, first of all, you were entering a building that is powered by electricity. Why did anyone ask, what is powering that building to give me Hollywood? Review. Solar energy manipulated by your solar plexus. You are that building. You are entering yourself. That's why Solomon's temple is real. The light proves this. Now, only intellectuals will say, that's reaching, that's a metaphor, you're just playing around. Well, when we were one years old, and if anyone is over-intellectual and they want to debunk you, you remind them they were one, eating their boogers, on mama's nipple, getting milk, crapping themselves. Ah! They were not resume, finger in your face. We were all a little bit confused and we must humble ourselves and go back to a one-year-old. This is why I see things differently. So why is numerology important back to that point again in what I'm doing in the light working? I am working with the numbers within my body. It's like martial arts, okay? Jedi mind tricks is real. Professor X, he's the crippled one, but the most powerful. Why? Because it's called the Christ Jesus. He sacrificed his limbs. He had to lose some shit to be the high mind. It's called you pay a price. I, I, I'm also crippled. Yeah, yeah. I have the Christ, okay? I, it's called dancing ballet, knee surgery, with scientists who gave me Frankenstein needles. Shoulder, to I've toned both um, rotator cuffs, bro. I'm fixing it, but long story short, I know. <clears throat> if you know your numbers and you research and look at what it relates to and what gods and what temples it might take you to and what ancient things, my numbers are taking me to ancient temples I've never even heard of before, ever. Just from looking at my video and my photo numbers, the last pair of numbers, anyone can do this. It's your subconscious mind and the elite know this. We are also the elite high, but your, your rich bloodline demonic people know that the phone is connected to the light from your solar plexus. It's not only radiation poisoning. You can convert it to use it for healthy stuff. I'm manipulating my numbers in the phone every day. I can make a screenshot KB size kilobytes, go to my number 537-185-531-155, and at least once or twice a day. Manipulate it. Those are my numbers, JHE and Chaldean and Pythagoras. Now, if you go to my Facebook page, JHE, R-U-S-S-E-L-L, -L, or once again, Razen617 on Instagram, it is your truth, not my page. That is called manipulating energy. Well, what is martial arts? Back to this stuff. And if you punch me, is the first thing I should do is punch you back? Or do I recover? I take my time. I absorb that. And then I just simply without force, I give it back to you with my words and my understandings of the number. So if you have a nine millimeter pistol, 
well, I have 22 bones in my skull. Isn't a gun also a 22 there, buddy? Yeah. You are awesome. You are also a weapon, people watching this. You're not all about love and peace only, boo-boos. Get that out of your heads, that you were only meant to sit lotus style and do yoga. That is good. Why? You have a phalange's bone in your body. Jay, what is a phalange's bone? You're a teacher. Skip this and your sifu and shame on them. It means a military complex. Your phalanges, look it up right now, or your phalanx. Etymology. Mm -hmm. You kidding me? Woo! Now watch me cook this. Yeah, baby. Let's go to the Boeing Jet 777. Why is it three sevens Boeing Jet, but not you and me? What's powering that plane? Gasoline? Bullshit. Part of my language. It's called the Egyptian gliders back in the day. It's a hieroglyph. And they cover it up so no one can see that we had flying technology. But what's making that plane? The air in your body is powering that plane. You should know that. Simple questions. This is deep, but not deep. What is powering the air that's keeping it afloat? Never mind who built the plane. You see, we skip out on nature, but we go to the man that made it. Here's a Bible. That's a, I can touch that. But what made the hand that made that Bible? God did. The what made God? Uh, another God. You have nowhere to go. <laughs> Not yeah, you're working. Right on. Yeah, you're right on. Dude, you're I get right. You don't have time, homies. Yeah. I don't care what your faith is. I don't care if you're an atheist. You can be whatever you want, boo boo. The reality is, it's better to agree to agree than disagree today because we have something coming to us very quickly that is going to hurt all of us. It's called the economy crashing. Now, Wall Street is nothing but numbers, yes or no? <laughs> it's all it is, algorithms. Algorithms. Good one you said there. Algorithms, okay? Now, when we think about rhythm now, we go back to our bodies. Here's your spine, 33 bones in it. It's sacred. You have the 33rd parallel north geographically. Do you know how to dance and move that spine, move those 33, and make them a, an 8 or a 9 or a 2 or a 12? You see where I'm going here? Your body is multiplied in major muscles in which your Muslims are the limb of a muscle. Blowing your mind. That, that is a yarmulke. It's a yarmulke. I put it on my head to the sun. Jews, Arabs, Mita, what's going on? You both pray on Saturday. Why? What's Saturn? What's Sabbat, honeys? Get right. Who is Allah? Who is Kabbalah? The number system of the Jew Jupiters? <laughs> it's all the same story. It's all the same shit. All the same story. It's all the same stuff. You and me are Kabbalists. You and me are both angel worshipers and devil worship. Of course, you have to have Deva, Mahadeva. <laughs> It's a goddess. It's, life can be a bitch. You want to know why? It's a vahina, the zero made your nothing world that made something. Now, you atheists and you anarchists better answer that because they'll tell you quickly, oh, everything is nothing, which they're kind of right, but they exaggerate. Mm -hmm. To have truth. Mm -hmm. To have truth. Yeah. But talk about, their, talk about their pop culture. Mention their favorite president. Oh, that one lived. Yeah, that one was real, though. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, I, I, Obama, Napoleon, um, the Beatles, Tupac, anyone but LeBron James, anyone but me. So they're real. They made you inspired. But we're not really here, though. Bueller, that's confusing. Okay? So this is why I'm here. Numbers will get to the point very quickly. So example, you push a button, that cross sign, what is a plus sign? It's the cross, right? It's the cross. Okay, now watch me cook this. And there's nothing wrong with the Bible or the Quran. You can still keep everything the way it is. Here is what I suggest, because your protesting is noisy, and it's scaring the crap out of animals and insects, and it's obnoxious. Stop protesting. And if you ate fast food before you protested, you just protested your intestines. You don't have the right to get mad at someone if you can't go up a flight of stairs. But I love you. Big facts. <laughs> That's it. Big facts. I love you. That's it. I don't want to hear no gender shit, no religious shit. If you aren't healthy physically and a good person, shh, now, simple.
here's what church and the mosque and the, the, the stupas, whatever that you call them, should be, or the ashrams. Before you give your sermon, every time you acknowledge that I have a solar plexus on Sunday and that I have 33 bones in my spine like Christ died, you start there. If it's Christianity, if it's India, guru, the first thing you tell me every sermon is Surya. Sanskrit means the sun, and you are all Surya. They don't do this. If you want to read and you got to pay for the guru to give you a deep reading now in the Vedic system. Hi, gurus. I love you. Sad guru. Freemasons probably. I'm not mad at them. You better ask why your sad guru did a damn presentation in a free Masonic lodge. But he's very good at what he does. Absolutely. Yeah, he has a responsibility. Absolutely. Okay. You need to ask questions and research people who watch this. And before you eat something, the first thing you do is you go to the back of the can or the back of the bag. Well, we don't do this. Maybe we get mad when we get cancer. It's a star system. Yes or no? <laughs> now, why you should know your numbers. I'm going to blow your eyes to be a dancer. I'm a rapper. I like to perform. What is stage four cancer and why is it on a stage? I've never even thought, never put that together. <laughs> Blow your damn mind. Watch me cook this with no animals. And please stop eating them if you are. I don't eat them. I do handstands and all the stuff. Who's watching? Protein. Let's go outside right now. Protein alpha males and see. Not wrestling. I mean, fitness. Yes. I will challenge you. Okay. <laughs> now, stage. Watch me cook this. People, pop culture loves to have people on stage for cancer. Hear me. What were you drinking when you saw Lady Gaga? Talk that shit, Jay. Oh, the gender movement, and I'm fluid. I'm, I'm pansexual, and I'm a Muslim, and I'm a vegan, and I'm an astrologer, and I'm a crystal, and I'm they. People, you're more than this. I'm not making fun of these things, but my God, it's, it's noisy. So... What were you drinking when the Rolling Stones were on stage? Pepsi causes you cancer on stage. They are dancing on you. Who's they, Jay? That is you and me to figure out. I can't tell you who they are because they're infinite. They're immortal. And it would be blasphemous and disrespectful to my enemy to describe what kind of a creature we are dealing with because it's very complicated. I was I'm taking... I was thinking instead of Pepsi, I was thinking of pop soda. Yeah, pop soda. That's the name, right? Your, <laughs> your pop is your Pope. Mm -hmm. Okay. What does he call himself? You people who are Catholics with low self-esteem. You want to know why you have low self-esteem and you're taking Viagra, bless you, and you're waiting for the game to come on to get an erection to sleep with your wife? Yeah. And if they win, woo! If they lose, though, she gets beaten maybe or ignored. Yeah. Hi. Okay. Your Pope calls himself Vicaris Philly Day. Latino people stand up. That's Latin. It's your language. That means the son of God. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> now I go back to you and me. Teacher, you told me I have a solar plexus and, and that I have the sun. So can I also be? Yes, you can. But they don't do that. Right. They don't do that. They said, you give me your money. I'm someone's bloodline. You don't know if I'm a pedophile or not. You don't know what I did before I even came into church. Good example, Crevlo Dollars, a black preacher who wanted to pay for a jet in a, in a cruiser, all that stuff. And he was a pedophile into little kids and shit, took, taking selfies. And we don't ask questions about these rich people wearing a suit, telling you how to praise the sun. You were not born in a suit. You were born in a birthday, hear me now, why I'm nude right now. You were naked in a suit of God, the generator of vitamin D. And take back your truth and take back your mental orgasms and stop faking them and saying that you are okay. It is okay to not be okay. Not all the time though, but it's okay to say, hey man, I'm woke, but I'm kind of messed up still. I'm still a bit of an asshole. Okay, so if you're a bit of an asshole, you're not really woke. It's how you deliver. Liver? Jay. Jay. Slow it down. Delivery. Deliver. 
En français is Libra. The book is Libra. Play with your words. Be the one-year-old. Go to the sandbox. Mira, get out of the damn corporate buildings with mercury, lead, and cadmium poisoning is all up in your plaster. Right? We're worried about the Ukraine. God bless everybody who died. I have Ukrainian friends and Russian friends. I'm a dancer. I dance in St. Petersburg. They didn't once mention my racial color. Ukrainians too. Oh, he's a good dancer. I like him. Before I woke up, they were good people. So we squash all this. You're watching TV to get your truth will get you killed. It is your own divine will to watch the control of the remote world. Now back to my numbers and what being numb is. Are you numb? Let me just interject real quickly on that Ukraine thought. Like you're saying, everything is an illusion. It's bread and crumbs. This is their MO. So I don't know if you guys have picked up on this, but with the Ukrainian colors, it's blue and yellow. Blue Ooh. and yellow has been the colors that have been significant for COVID. Woo! You are a genie, Capital Cord. Anyways, I just wanted to throw that in there. It's, it's all psychological. Like you said, we're not dealing with physicality. We're dealing with now Let's go to Wiz Khalifa. Let's go to Wiz Black and Yellow, Black and Yellow. Even Jay, slow it down. Jay, that's just a rap song. He's too dumb to know what he's. The Wizard of Oz, Wiz. I'm going to take a whiz on you. It's a urine metaphor. Why? Another thing you should get into, people, for diet, urine therapy. I drank my morning urine. My hair grew back. It's high in phosphorus. Look it up. And it means the morning star in etymology. <laughs> so how could something gross relate to Venus in etymology? And Lucifer, too. But that's a lot of information. Okay, so now, go ahead, go ahead. Well, talking about that, it's, it's all phonetics, like you said, it's, it's a spell. So basically the reason why we have been indoctrinated to think that urine is bad is because they changed the pronunciation. It was orin, it was never urine. So urine is close to yuck. So that's why it sounds like, you see what I'm saying? <laughs> orin is gold. And we all know who orin is, Orion's belt. So it's all correlation. Wow. I'm, I'm gonna that's what, real, yeah, I'm going to be real with you. I've done a lot of these kinds of presentations before. That's the most fire build I've seen someone do. And that's a compliment coming from someone like myself, only because I have walked the path and I'm seeing magic. That brother was magic. Thank you for sharing that one. You're right. Yeah. Orange, Orion. Um, let's go into what a vegan is. Vegan comes from Vega, the star system Vega. Las Vegas nerve is your 13th nerve, uh, is a number. Okay, now back to colors, black and yellow, black and yellow, Wiz Khalifa now. Your Uranus, urine, is usually green, emerald, even green for Venus's stone. You go to the Kaaba of Mecca, when you go inside the Kaaba, boom, apparently that thing is covering a green meteorite that hit, known as Moldavite, apparently. But you can't go there. Yeah, go and look at what's under that Kaaba, the cube of Mecca. It's Venus, green. So now, black and yellow would be your black sun. That rules Capricorn, the Sabbath, the Saturn, the Satan, the first rung of the rainbow. It's not all evil, but of course it would be dark. It was the first baby. Think about the first baby on earth, people. Just think, was it someone good or bad? It didn't even know what a language was. Right. Think, think. So we have made mistakes. We're paying for it now, but we're supposed to be better now. We have the internet. Your ancestors didn't have it. We have some stuff we can use. We have awesome guys doing podcasts using this platform. When you use it, don't waste it. Don't waste it on Division, on Will Smith, Slap, Chris Rock. I don't want to hear that crap either. Right. You guys are only watching for the Ukrainian war. Ukraine? Crane is a bird. And the crane was, I don't know, um, the Karate Kid's martial arts style got to wake up people this is all happening and all related okay how many birds die before humans die never mind war how many birds get sacrificed for chicken and protein and grass fed these terms are very very lethal why i'll tell you this that has a heart like you and me that has a stomach that's different from you and me and it has someone's it gives birth from a vagina and it has organs to have sex with so when we eat it we're eating someone's child now when this chicken dies what do you think happens 
It perpetuates man's DNA, his carbon 12, his 666, to go what? To go ham? To eat the ham? Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. You better go and give me your land and your daughter. And go to Gujarat, India, and it's, God bless them, it's Hindus and Arabic people who've lost their way, raping and killing the women of India, their own people. And they praise Krishna and Buddha. It's why it's not working. I don't have time for games. And I don't care about tattoos. I don't care about chakra flags. That own thing is cute. I'm not saying don't do that. You must know where you are because we're at war. So black and yellow is your black sun, Saturn. And then simply your red and blue blood, people. What makes your blood red and blue, a crip in the blood? So we're always gangbanging, aren't we? But we're not gangbanging to kill somebody. We're gangbanging to kill all the energy to make a life because life comes from death. Now that was deep. Hmm. You need your gangsters to go the other way. We need them. We need martial art. Yes, sadly, we do need guns and stuff for protection. Yes, they're crazy, demented, that will hurt and take all the years of what we worked for. Even if you meditate, honeys, you go to ancient India, a temple called, a fort called Daltabad, D-A-U-L-T-A-B-A-D-A. -A -A. How'd I find that? Daltabad? Dalta, Daltabad, yeah. It's a temple or a fort that was built by Buddhists. And they were prepared for anyone to invade by pouring hot oil on you and burning you to death. If you got into the wrong part of the fort, they would trap you. They had cannons with Arabic writing on it in India, Buddhist temple of nonviolence, and they had a room to meditate in and a room to kill your ass in. And you call them crazy? Boo boo, you and I can't make that fort like they did. Go and try to make a fort out of a mountain right now and you'll be crying. They made forts out of a mountain. How? That would be magic and numbers. They knew the uh, two, three vibration. Uh, get left, right, left. What is that left, right, left, right? Left, it's one, two. Microphone check, one, two. Who is this? Your heart goes one, two, not one point. Uh, 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 uh. Dudes, what's, what's up, people? You're being two-timed. Yeah, that's why with the cadence, I know for because my father was a Marine, so understanding numbers, a cadence is one, two, three, hut. So they do things in three. That's your trinity, your one, two, and three, A, B, C. Exactly. That's why even in marketing, you'll see it all over social media. They do steps of three because people have been indoctrinated to three is just a magical number, as we're talking about. So, yeah. So we have a threesome. P people who are freaky, I don't judge you. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Three's company. Three's company TV show. Three's company is three C. Jay, slow it down. That's C, 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 it's six, 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 six. Your Foo Fighters, F O O is six, six, six. F O O is three sixes. And then a drummer dies in a hotel, like Bob Saget of Family, what, family House, was some TV show he was in. Full House, that? yeah, Full House. Full House. And he cracked his face fell but he has cracks that only a gorilla could do to him okay i'm not trying to go there either really i don't care but people love this shit they love that stuff okay kim kardashian and kanye going at it watch this kim kardashian is kk kanye <laughs> watch me cut right this right yep. in your face yes. it's right there kk six it's not the racist thing with the hoods Get it out of your head. They were Freemasons. <laughs> Do not mix the clan with racism only. They were into esoteric Kabbalah of Samaria. You better wake up, but you'll never know that. It's called a secret society. But I am here to expose that part of it, yes. And I will live and die for that. I have no fear. I fear no one. I know where I'm going when I die. It's called Planet Taurus. You love planets. By the way, Earth is the only planet. Everything else is an orb or a mist. This is the only solid illusion here, okay? Your red and blue blood is a Taurus field. Look up a T-O-R-U-S field and ask yourself, why is it sounding an awful lot like Bull Durham, Raging Bull, Sandra Bullocks. They say bollocks in England, mate, bollocks. Oh, I know my stuff. It does not allow you to get out of it. It, it forces you to hug me, my words. And this is why what I do is very intimidating because it's very focused and it's laser sharp to prove that you and me 
are the most high, right? This idea of I'm a truther, but you're a listener. Hey, anyone in the podcast listening, you're also a podcaster. Okay. Right. You're important, dude. You can do this. Don't worry about being good at it. What is good? Who told you good and bad? Who was that? Was that, was that a good person? Oh, your professor. Does he smoke cigarettes? Does he eat fast food? Don't judge him, but look at his behavior. They do. They eat KFC and come in there and tell you Einstein's theory. <laughs> and I'm crazy for being skinny and muscular and whatever, not into animals. I've seen stars move. I filmed it. I have it on my YouTube. A star was moving. Those get low views. My magic videos get low views. I'm not bitter about this, but I must address this for people listening here. If you really want to expand and get better, you should do what my man here is doing for me. He's helping me get more known. He's helping to expand my world. And I'm grateful for this. This is what my truth is. It's like tomato paste. Tomato paste makes the tomato sauce thicker. More interesting, right? That's like your food. If most people thought like their food, they wouldn't cook jack shit. It would be bland. It'd be one thing. And you wouldn't have cuisine, dude. That's why I tell, yeah, that's why I tell people like this is, it's just simple when they ask, I tell them, you're not really eating meat. You're eating the flavor of the meat because you wouldn't eat meat raw. What do you do with meat? You season it. So it's the yeah. flavor. It's the flavor. You're not, it's, people need to understand. That's why we don't eat meat. You know what I mean? It's the seasoning. That that's what you're Hey, That was a brilliant way, man. I've never heard that one. That's genius. That's really what it is. It's that's not totally really that. Yeah, we, we're being taught this way, you know, for generations because of these entities. But the thing about it is that we don't eat wow. meat because we're carnivores. It's because of the seasoning. You would never eat raw flesh. Right. Never. So what do you got to do with the meat? You have to season it so it tastes as good. So if you take that same seasoning and you put it on fruits or vegetables, it's the same thing. You're eating flesh. That's wow. how I see it. Yeah, that's how I see it. I had to serve the leg of a lamb to a customer yesterday, and I felt like a complete ass man. I touched it. I looked at it, and that's all she wanted was a leg and a bag bleeding. And she asked me if I'm okay. And I have to say, well, I'm only as good as you. And they say they're good, but they're not. Right. Some of them are really sick and they're eating things that are making them worse. And I can't say anything because if I say something, what happens is I'm going to pull out my number two pencil. Oh, it's a number two pencil. But if I go to the bathroom, a number two is talking shit. It takes two to tango. Tan is 10. Two hands of the Kabbalah, 10 spheres. You are the Kabbalah. Allah is in Ka, Egyptian soul. Ba, Egyptian soul. La is Egyptian, not Judaism only, baby. Happy Hanukkah. Oh, wait a minute. I mean harmonica. J. Yeah, it's called but rhythms, right? The algorithms, man. You're gonna check it. When someone talks to you, what's up? No, it's just my day. Come on, man. We just actually, yeah, it's been a, a crazy day not to cut you off, but we just rescued this pit bull. He's actually been sitting here the whole time, so he's just chilling in my in my energy, but she came in to check on him, but go ahead. It's a pit bull? Yeah, it's a, it almost got hit. Was getting, You know what I mean? was lost. We try to post it everywhere to see where the owners were at. Haven't gotten a response, so in the time being, I'm being can a babysitter. See, can we see your dog? Can we see this dog, please? Yeah, he's laying down. Uh, I can't move. If I can get him to move, once he gets up, I'll bring him over in. Cause he's like, Don't yeah, Don't he's work. sleeping right now. I think he's yeah, it's Let he's in rest. a new okay. place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I'm gonna tell you something about that. That's really great. So, a lot of us that um that wake up still have a lot of work to do for karma. And if you don't believe in karma, then what is it doing in your car? And why is your car called Soul? There's a company called Soul and Saturn Cars. We know. Right. Okay. Karma. Take roadkill off of the road. Put it on the grass. Give it a blessing. Take it off of the road. Do not let it get hit more. And if it's got blood and guts, you put your gloves on. And you, yes, if you watch Jason and Freddy Krueger movies and Dexter and The Walking Dead, 
you can handle the guts and the throat of the thing that you call protein and put it on the grass. A good car? No. Now, yeah, car. Yeah, go ahead. Sorry, pardon me. No, no, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I was just going to go back to a connection to Saturn. And that's the whole thing is when you, when you really, that's why people need to do their research. That's, everybody knows the reason why I do this is to get to people to think. We're not here to tell you to do anything. It's for you to discover who you are and the power that you walk in. So you had levels of intelligences. You had your Christians, Hebrews. These, these weren't people, nations, races, a group of people. These were level of intelligences. And it goes all the way back to your solar, your lunar, your sidereal, and your Saturnians. And you can tell right now who's ruling that energy now is the Saturnians. That's why they took the celestial, moved it from Aries. Now it's in January and the beginning of the year it literally falls on 10, 10 degrees of Capricorn. Nice. So every, yeah, everything is, everything is Saturnian, like you're saying. And, and going back to Ukraine, um, if you know the, uh, the powers of interchangeable of letters, that's Kronos. Kronos is, cr yeah, that's all. It's all about Saturn worship. It's all about Saturn worship. Now, what kind of bird is this crane? Could it be a Kronos? Rawr! Yeah, baby. Better watch your birds. They're telling you something. Absolutely. Continue. I saw, yeah, I saw a crow cheat death. Talk about low self-esteem how this crow did this right in front of me yesterday. So I'm going outside. There's a car going right fast, like just boom. There was a piece of food in front of the car. What did the crow do? The crow swooped down, grabbed the food, just missed the windshield and flew away. Okay. And it was probably a freaking Dorito or something. Okay. Don't eat that shit. Yeah. Don't eat anything. But they're far wiser than us Dorito eating, Bud Light drinking. What were you eating at the concert? Was it Snickers? And why is Coke and Pepsi in your ER in your hospital? You should be asking them questions. Take back your truth the right way. Don't be obnoxious. Be a scholar. You're better than um, someone angry only and bitter about it. Well, okay, you were asleep. Now you're awake. What are you going to do about it? What am I doing? I am in the community providing holistic dance, which I'll explain as five. There are five major positions in ballet. First position, second, third, fourth, and fifth. Look at a simple. Those are my hand and your hand, yes or no. You are a ballet dancer. That's a ballet. Doing this, the mudras. You understand me? I am dancing now with the moon, maybe. I have a lunate moon bone in my hand. Look it up. Luna is in your hand, your wrist. If you break that, you break the bond with your James Bond. I mean, your Joe Biden. I mean, your Joaquin and Boaz temple for Freemasonry. Your Jungle Book. Your Jungle Brothers rap group. Jay. The pattern. I see the number. One, two, three. Mind control goes one, two, three. It goes, I watch TV, I watch that, I go outside, that's one, two, three. Yeah, you're moving, Calcul there's a calendar. They get you right there. Bullshit, why? And okay, the calendar is only useful for what? For Columbus Day, MLK Day, Veterans, what about the damn pedestrian day who got killed by the bomb that I paid for? How about collateral damage day? How about economic sanction starving children day in which now we're over exaggerating and starving all of Russia, Ukraine, and now America's going to get it. You're going to lose people driving cars. You better, you better grow shit and have um, farmer friends. I have many. Thank God. I'm in a co-op. Yeah, now, five, yes, sir. You have five elements like in ballet, earth, water, air, fire, and ether. And darn Einstein for damning it. But he changed his mind on his deathbed, but it was too late. He died. Then he woke up. You don't want to be dead woken up. You're here to help your children. They have a bad deal, dude. Because parents are killing them with diet. This, no research, and watching shit all day. And just this. Look, just look at the word diet. Take the T off of it. Yep. It's right in the word. There's no such thing as a diet, you guys. <laughs> you die. You die. Then you meet Diana. Well, who is she in etymology? Diane is the moon. Who do you think handles your soul? The moon. Mm -hmm. Jay, how do you know that? Jay, prove it. As below, so above. Watch me cook this. It's called life insurance. Okay. Life is infinite. And um, who is this person I'm giving my insurance to? 
a human for my life, which is infinite, which is a solar plexus, which is light energy. So how'd they do that down here to figure that out? That system of, I'm gonna put your soul in a document. Your life insurance is your life. Mm -hmm. This is an insult, okay? So this means your stars came before us. The moon came before us. The moonwalk is cute. But I prefer the worm, baby. I'm the earth worm and I break dance. I'm breaking down and I break the waters of mother nature. You women should love that. And you women, be careful who you date. Men too, but women, be careful. Your low self-esteem will get you killed too. And you've gotten a bad deal with your symbols repressed women. I understand that. But don't over-exaggerate and date someone who's a low octave and have children that are low octaves. And you know what I mean. McDonald's, bullying, sports, protein, church, judgment, gossip. This is what parents are doing to their kids. Give them a phone and let that child watch that phone. They're watching porn now. Okay? You know that. You can watch any part of porn on the phone for free. We know this. Easy. Okay? So your child needs to have a fighter. So the five elements of ballet, I teach the earth, water, air, fire, and ether, and I associate that with you. And then we dance with the first element. I'll keep it simple. I won't go to all of them. The first element is the cube and geometry. And what you can do a lot of stuff with the cube. You feel me? You can turn your hands a different way. And then, so basically what you're doing is dancing with your Kaaba. Jewish people, it's called a Teflon on your forehead. It's this dude. Hi. So if I'm doing a sacred geometry with my body, I'm creating a powerful force to heal myself from what? Low self-esteem. I can't. Oh, I couldn't do that. No, the numbers will help you. How, Jay? There are five points to a star and you have a head, two arms, and two legs. So why did the Star Spangled Banner tell you that? It's a good point. If I go to the Hollywood Walk of Fame, right? Raphael, and I see the ground, they have those stars with how many points? Five, right? But I have five, and I can't get one? Yeah, you guys should check it out. They have uh, all the astronauts who went to the moon have a star. Yeah. You got to, it just makes you, it's a Hollywood. It's, it's an act. It's an act. Oh, what a great acting that was. Once again, stage four cancer. Stage four. They're putting you on a stage. Why is it type two diabetes? Type two, type three? These numbers people are killing us. Your scientists need to know your numbers. So you must know you have 22 bones in your skull, fact. And you have a seven pH balance, fact. 22 divided by seven gives you the number of pi, fact. You should be blown right now and like, holy shit, I'm going to do something different today and I'm going to share that with somebody as opposed to, is it a man? Is it a woman? Illuminati. What is he eating? Who is he sleeping with? Uh, Will Smith and Chris Rock again. Uh, Madonna, Madame X, uh, Lady Gaga, people. LeBron, J Kyrie Irving, uh, the, the people. They don't care about you. They never will. They'll never even meet you, but you know them. Meet meet you meet is also t-e-a-m team your animals are on your team you used to ride them there are many east indians who defeated the british not enough of them riding a bull riding a horse not eating it okay elephants people we used to do this what are we doing we're driving a hummer you used to drive an elephant boo boo all of us a rhinoceros yeah, a gorilla probably. Sure. We died in the process, but we're still here. Right? If it's the end of the world, listen, you people who think it's going, okay. FEMA camps, all right. First of all, that's your femur bone. You get thrown in the camp, you get thrown in the camp wise, and you turn that camp into an ashram. It's my femur bone, it's FEMA. 
I'm starving now and I lost my, my Wi-Fi, I lost my car, I lost my job, I lost my access to my food, didn't lose my access to my numbers and my wisdom because Raphael and Jay and Razen did a podcast and they reminded me that this camp is named after my bone. And that makes me feel good right now. Because I don't have anything else to see, but what? You, if you're thrown in the hole in jail, wake up people, it's real shit. Why is it the hole? Hmm. Rough in there, man, dark. You don't eat, no, and they give you horrible things. You're treating a human this way? You can survive that if you know who you are. You get in that hole, no problem. Jay, how do you do that? It's called, how were you born? You were born through darkness. Your mother's womb was black. You were in there for nine months, bars, and you're out of shape. This is all normal for you. Oh, but you forgot, because now you're a thug. Now you're uh, someone's child. You're, right. you're guilty, you're innocent, you're a pot dealer, you're a truther. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. You are more than this. So the whole is the holy zero point. The black sides of the screen right here for this Zoom. The black of your eye is where you come from is Saturn's world, baby. And you better know how to stay in an uncomfortable place for at least two hours, just out of respect for those who died before you and me. Put yourself in some discomfort on purpose. Don't hurt yourself, but you should do that. It's called Shaolin. They're not doing it to be tough and strong. They're doing it to suffer because they know they had guilt from their ancestors dying from stupidity and they weren't there to help them. And they had guilt. Of course it's guilt. Buddhism is not just about being perfect and balanced. It's about, damn, I'm a bit fucked up. Part of my language. I'm, you know, I did some shit in my past life. So I'm gonna suffer a bit, man. Okay, I'm not gonna kill myself. That's how you become stronger, you know? You, you learn from everything that you can and you make your own version today, which is what my numerology is simply a new version of old things that have been here for thousands of years. Why is it called A1 sauce? A1 sauce? <laughs> People, do you know what that number is? A is one, it's 11. Right. Wake up, 7-Eleven is the dimension of the Pyramid of Giza. This is 7-Eleven, 20, even 24. 24 hour is six. But H and R is also a letter. H is eight, R is nine. Whoop, you're, you're entering a temple. Every place is sacred now, even McDonald's. They know what they're doing to you. All of your little fast foods are ones and twos. Let me get a happy meal, number one. Let me get a quarter pounder or quarter pounder with cheese. Quarter is 25. Hmm. Now watch this, the queen. Regina did this to you, my mom's name, and she beat the crap out of me. And when I asked for an apology, disown me. It's okay. Women also abuse too. Victimization, no more of this. Men suffer too from women who are abusive. We must talk about these things. That's truth. Not just the earth, diet, is it a man, and Illuminati, and pedophiles, and gargoyles. You are all of those things, by the way, metaphorically, if you look into it. Regina gives birth to register, regis. Rahina, the queen. Now, when I go to McDonald's, is there not a register in front of me? The person doesn't know this. Right. You are now, yes, you are dancing with the queen. 11 is two, is the high priestess in the tarot. That's why you know your shit to know who is doing this to you. Your mama is spanking you. Yes, she will kill you if you don't know her truth. It's called cancer. An accident. The sun's not going to stop the car coming while you're in the phone, people. <laughs> so your astrology should not be so you know dramatic it should be simple and you you align me with it in every sermon everything that's said before you talk about any damn thing in a book you make sure you mention me and Raphael have what is called neptune's chariot in my hippocampus what does that mean now
Neptune is nine. Nep, nove, Nova Scotia, supernova. Hmm. Navajo, Navagraha. Mm -hmm. Just say these words. Don't even worry about making sense, people. See, I'm talking to you, and you're probably like, what the hell is he? I know. What the? That's the good thing. That part where you go, what the hell is he? Do? Yeah, just do it. Think. Don't think, feel. Isn't that what um, Bruce Lee said? Don't think. Okay. Feel and talk. You are speaking the words of God and making your life better. And you don't even know it. Know your mantras. Know Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna has a number to it. An AK-47. Alicia Keys. Akhenaten. AK. You want to play games here with patterns, pop culture? And those who are watching us, hi, big brother. Hi, big sister. I'm grateful. I love you. If it wasn't for you, Raphael and I wouldn't be strong people today. Thank you for poisoning appreciate us. Appreciate you. Yeah, appreciate love you. you. We're not going to hate on you on this channel. We're not going to get... Hey, and by the way, you don't want to get banned? That's how you don't get banned, by the way. You go to etymology, fact. You go to the source and show it. And you talk to them when you do your, your bills and say, hey, thank you because they're into rituals. The Rothschild family, whatever these names are, I won't get too deep. Your Freemasons, no, they have to also use the truth. They have to use the truth to get you to lie. They have to show their hands. They, yes. So if you do a truthful thing, they have to accept you. But we're not. We're getting mad at them. Ah, you know what I mean? And then we're protesting for George Floyd, but you didn't protest McDonald's? In your ghettos, Wendy's, come on, Taco Bell, Bell, El, Elohim. Raphael is also Mercury, by the way. Raphael is Mercury. Toth. Everyone look it up right now. In your brain, you have what is called an R-A-P-H-E. You have a Rafa nerve. Raphael is you and me, is Buddha also. Buddha, B-U-D-H-A in Sanskrit, means Mercury. I simplified Thousands of sutras. I've simplified your Quran. I've simplified your darn Torah. I've sim but you still want to read? There are missiles dropping now. Boom, someone going to get blown up. You want to read, honey? And watch that guy talk to you about God when he didn't tell you that you are it. And you better fix this broken house. Because if we don't, here's the reality. We're going to lose. And accept the losing then. When you lose, don't you complain about losing it. You accept it like a real warrior. And you put your head in shame. And you say sorry to your creators. And you deal with it. And you get back on your damn horse. And you take it back because you can always get it back. You can always get it back. If not, why did I grow from one years old to 45? I would have been dead at one month old. If God wants me to be depressed, on medication, picking a side, I'd be dead and you'd be dead. If your Adam thought like your Democrat and Republican, which is magnetic and electric, your Adam wouldn't make a body. It would be like, I'm gonna go with this Congress here. I'm gonna go wear a blue tie and I'm gonna wear a red tie. Obama wears red and blue ties. Look it up. Joe Biden wears red and blue ties. Trump wore red and blue. I stop there. People, it is a game. Yes. They're in bed with each other. That's a fact. Don't go reading and going deep with research. You don't have time to be a dumb dumb. You're not dumb. You thought you were. You thought you were. That's why going back to Mercury, like you said, in America here, we're all little Mercuries. It's in the name America Mercury. That's why it was named that because of comrades. Yes. It's all business. Business as usual. And your colonists got up in your anus. Okay. They did. Now, Uranus means sky in Greek. So anytime someone is raped, the dome of the sky feels that. Wow. Yes, baby. And when you die, you'll get dealt with for that vibration. It has to. They're all bells. They mm -hmm. vibrate on your behavior because you have a Neptune's chariot and you have a colon and an Anunnaki, an anus, an Anu. Who is Anu? Some statue in Samaria. It's you. I don't care what time. I don't care who built that temple. I don't care. Great. 
you. The temple is you. Ask that one that built that temple. You can't build. Ask them, could you please build a human body right now? And they'll be like, holy shit, we need sperm to do that. And you made bricks out of silica, my sperm mother. Drink your urine. And if you waste your minerals, drink that other thing too. Don't, don't call it gross. If you ate fast food, yeah. If you like Twizzlers, do you know what's in Twizzlers? Yeah, I already showed my kids. Red number two. Mm -hmm. Right away, red and pig lard. It's not really what it is. Now, a customer who eats animals, ironically, told me a very funny, not funny, interesting point as to why people eat, eat pig. Do you know why bacon in the pig industry was created? It was to stop humans from eating human flesh. Mm -hmm. Cannibalism was big back in the day. And Buddhism was brought by, by the, look it up now, research everything I say. Buddhism was made because of the human sacrifice and to stop the human sacrifice. Hence, ahimsa. But you got damn temples. I told you, Daltabad, but they had cannons now coming to kill you and pour hot oil on you because people are so crazy and dumb. We are that bad. So you better get ready for warfare and be physically fit enough to protect yourself. Learn your own version of martial arts. You figure it out. Why not? You're afraid of looking dumb? I'll tell you what looks dumb. Me eating a, uh, a quarter pounder with cheese and watching LeBron James. And then talking shit about it. And be like, oh, he sucks today, but I'm eating fast food. You people. And anyone who's judging any actor, any actor, okay, so I have compassion for the actors. Okay, actors, we, we spanked you, sellouts. You fans who are lazy and eat the junk food and poison yourself and are overweight and you know that. Shame on you on medication and you're getting mad at your celebrities because they did this and did that. Well, what are you doing to your body? That's what numerology is. Get you out of your generic. Let's get to the point. You, are you good? Now let's go fix this broken house. If you're not good, then don't say you woke. Don't force it down someone's throat. Don't hurt anybody because I'm here to help that shit too. I'm here to stop beefing. Beef, why is it called beef? Okay? To be bovine is to be thick. En français, money is l'argent. Large. Calf, the cafeteria. You are eating a sacred thing, boo-boos. And the dome can feel everything that comes out of your anus. When you shit as well, the sky vibrates off of your asshole. Yeah. yeah. That's deep. That's deep shit. That's deep why it's called deep. Yeah, why it's, oh, that's deep shit. Because your shit is the truth. It is. It tells you. Woo, this is the best one I've ever done in my life. What is horse manure? You better maneuver. Maneuver? Minerva? Oh, yeah, that owl god, Bohemian Grove, that, you know, your politicians do weird shit at. You know, none of you ask questions. Never mind Alex Jones, all controlled opposition, anonymous. And they're cute, but just be careful with these people because they're all controlled. Yeah, they all have a responsibility. That's what I say. And this is what I tell people, too. You have to really start thinking and seeing things. You know, not with your physical eyes, your binocular eyes, but you got to start yeah. seeing things. People who are most popular on any type of like radio, music, social media, YouTube, whatever it is, you have to question that. There's a reason why they're popular. These people, these people are chosen. You see what I'm saying? Podcasts like this, it doesn't matter about the views. Whoever is watching this, love you, thank you. Take this truth and run with it. Do your own research and spread it. This is what needs to be spread. You know what I mean? Absolutely. We're chosen in a different way. You see yes. what I mean? So, no, I'm absolutely. going to address um, Joe Rogan. <laughs> My name is Jay Russell, JR. Who shot JR, Dallas? Okay, now, very famous podcaster, right? CNN is mad at him now because they're getting low views and mm. we know they're, they're both controlled, right? So, very simple. We look at the resume a little bit here before we talk about the, anyone look at Joe Rogan. It's called Fear Factor. Remember that TV show? Mm -hmm. It was a small little TV. It was esoteric as a mother. What was he doing? He was encouraging people to eat 
and do things with insects, fear factor, promoting the fear. Now we had Cape Fear and Fear Factor is Foo Fighter with that drummer all of a sudden, and they have a movie called 666, the, the Foo Fighter movie in which they all get killed by the leader of the band and no one asks questions. Hmm. Yeah. So Joe Rogan does Fear Factor, promoting fear and satanic eating of creatures and laughing at you. And now he's got a, a podcast. Okay, well, people, wake up. This is a man about ratings, okay? He's good at ratings. The ratings is what gets you to watch stuff. Even truthers are smart with this. You're being tricked with that one too. And he can have Santos Bonacci on his show one day. I don't care who's on it. That one is controlled and his friends back with Anton LaVey's son. Just like the, yeah, go ahead. Just, yeah, just like the popular channel now that's blowing up, Gaia. Gaia. It's super controlled, but people don't see that. They don't see it because they give you half truths. And if you don't do your research, you're going to fall for anything. Like, Here's how you can tell someone is shilling, like Neil deGrasse Tyson, these, <laughs> these people, how they, this, you look at their body. You can just look at them. Yeah. Now, this is not about making fun of people. Who no, struggle. it's not. No, it's, it's not. You look at their being body. Being real. Yeah, we're being real. <laughs> and you look at what they ate before the lecture. You ask them, where'd you go to eat? I'm just curious. Just ask these questions. That's conscious. Oh, I went to Subway. Okay, that's a dumb dumb. Okay. Neil is out of shape. They're all sickly. You go to Gaia. I've seen um, Gaia commercials. And every time they have someone speaking for the Gaia about aliens and the Babylonian stuff, in truth, usually it's a balding, overweight, glasses, protein eating, intellectual Einstein person, Darwin person. You know it's bullshit when they don't look like you, me, and Raphael here. Females too. Okay. Whoopi Goldberg is talking shit. Whoopi Goldberg is almost the size of Aretha Franklin before she died. That's so, even Whoopi. If that's even her. That's even her. Right? <laughs> is it a man, right? Is it a robot? I don't know. What I do know is this. Only speaking about those things is getting us killed. Only speaking about the drama. Raphael has a solution. Raphael's a father, first of all. He's taking care of a dog. Raphael likes to take care of diet and share with you how to eat. I've seen his posts about food. And I'll tell you, uh, Raphael, what I'll share with, uh, with uh, my frustration. The low views someone gets for sharing. Did you know that a broccoli has more protein than beef? You'll see like eight, you know. And I, I look at that. And I, I think to myself, wow. Then you go to another Instagram page. And you see a beautiful woman with a bum bum out and tits. Beautiful. Listen, I love women, okay? It's cool. Right. Women, calm down. God. Women, damn it. You're powerful. It's too much. It's everywhere. <laughs> it's everywhere. <laughs> oh, my God. And I'm lustful. I am lustful. I'm being honest. Stop. So, you know what <laughs> No shit. And they're beautiful. And they're, you know, doing the thing and the nipples are out. 10,000 views, right? But I'm like, okay, but what came before her? A broccoli did. <laughs> Damn, I feel bad for the broccoli. Even the broccoli's like, it was like, what the fuck, man? You don't like me? I grow for free. I don't ask you to grow. I don't ask you to tell me shit. You put me in the ground, homie, and I give it to you for free, and then you sell me? You have an opinion now about politics? Something's thing, wrong. Yeah. Love the analogy, but I just, this is what I know from what I researched. Broccoli was made in a lab. It's in the word. Brock, it's a crock. It was made in a lab. So don't eat broccoli. Wow. Okay, wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> but not taken away from your analogy, of course, you get low views. What about kale? What about kale? Oh, kale's amazing. Kale's amazing. Kale is Kali. Cauliflower God. is your bronchitis, is your broccoli. But you can still use broccoli and alchemize and take the good parts and spit out the bad parts if you right. detox <clears throat> enema flushed. Trust me, your poison people only put things in it 
to add to the truth of it. So you can, your DNA can take out all the bad. Wear silver. Silver does that. Silver removes the viruses directly off of your cells. Not gold. Gold is actually arsenic. I, I learned that the hard way. And copper. Wearing these things, copper is healthy, but silver, simple. I'm learning too. So sure. if your temple is strong enough, all I'm saying is you can survive all the poisons, even these cancerous cigarette smoking people. Earthing. Walk barefoot, dude. Why? Jay, could you please go back to your smart voice and back to your numbers and your... Uh... You need more turkey, Jay. Jay, you're looking a bit skinny. And do you have any kids yet, Jay? You got it. Okay, shut up. These people. I love you, though. Now, Earth is the cube in geometry fact. Look it up. It has six faces and four sides or something. Six and four is your what? Ninten, Nintendo. Okay. We have a cuboid bone in our foot. When you walk barefoot, what do you think you're doing? You're adding. Adam. You're adding to your body. And it's incredible. And that's called magic of numerology. And that's why my numbers appear. And no one taught me this. It's called being curious and having my own version of martial arts, ballet, astrology. You can all do your own version, by the way. Don't let someone swindle you and sway you. Self-confidence is the thing here. We want people to believe in themselves. It's the lack of belief that has us divided in religion. And I'll tell you this. Uh, uh, my coworker said, this is a good point. Why doesn't everyone in religion pray to the grim reaper? Literally, think about this. You go into the Christian church. The first thing I see is a dead man with a crown in his head bleeding. It's a funeral. Think about it. it, it it's scary. It's scary when I was a kid. I was like, what is this? He's dead. That always bothered me as a kid. And now he's on a stick? Like, and I'm singing to this shit? Can I pull him off? I wanted to pull him off, dude. No, I wanted to like pull him off. I was that kid. I was like, if I pulled him off, would he still... His eyes are open. This is a good point. Now, damn it, people wake up. How many people die over Islam? We know this. Mm. How many Hindus are killing in Gujarat, India over Krishna? We know this. And raping women. And the police who pray to Shiva cover it up. Damn it. Death. Okay, cool. Let's go to Israel. They're killing the Palestinians and so forth for Jew, for Adam and Abraham. So we know that we relate in death. So why don't we all simply pray to the Grim Reaper? You want to know why we don't do that? Because we like to put frosting on our misery. We like to dance around it and see it bleeding, but it's still kind of awake and open like the Christ on that cross. We like to see death that's still kind of living. We don't want to just get it right away the way it's supposed to be. It's a good point. Of course, you wouldn't worship a dead body. You're a life force. You're here for life. Someone no likey you on earth, and I understand. It's called the Mahabharata. No one understands that story. The Pandavas and the Karuvas. It's a real story. It's about the making of the waters of Indra, India. It's about the making of the earth, then the human, which means your earth did not get along with earth. It's called mountains are scarred tissue and fossils of creatures, yeah. Now marinate on that. Every mountain, yeah, was a stone giant apparently, or it's a life force that made it, but it's an injured thing. It's a tumor sticking out. If you will go to fly over the earth and see it, it wouldn't be as beautiful. You're being tricked. It's showing you, you. Hmm. And then having you go on vacation and, and get it. Oh, I'm gonna build a cottage by that mountain. It's a symbol of death, honey. It is. Oh, yeah. It's called Shiva is every mountain. You know who Shiva rules? Death. Death. But no one asks why. They think it's evil. It can be, yes. We know it works with death. Does it work with life, people? Hey, gurus of India, come on, guys. Come on, really? You, you Islamists, really? The island of the Lamb of God, the Lambdoid people, really? 
Hare Krishna, what is wrong? You let someone pep talk you into going out and raping a little Indian boy and then giving him drugs in the Congo of Africa to become a, a, a what? An extremist? Giving them heroin and you go to church? It's not working. Why are you praising a white man with crown? You should be praising the Grim Reaper. Oh, you like life though. You're confused. This is a deep build. Now, when I go into a building, all I want to see is life. I don't want to see anyone dead. And promote me being alive and put me in the story. If Christ was a carpenter, Mita, Raphael, how many people you know can build an incredible this and incredible that? <clears throat> a lot. I can. So here's a very good sermon. <clears throat> Good morning, everyone, because they're all bored and tired from having affairs, going to the casino, going to the strip club, drinking whiskey and watching porn and cheating. They're all tired. They, they can't hear the preacher. He's like, good morning. You all know Christ was a carpenter. Like Jimmy over here. Jimmy built our little our chapel down there. That's how you make it. Yeah. And then, oh, yes, I am a Christ. I am like, I am a, you aren't a Christian. It's bullshit. You are the Christ. You aren't a Muslim. You are the muscle. The body. Ha. Allah u ak aqua. Agua mira akbar. I'm spitting bars when I rap. 16 bars is 16. Back to why is it 16 and sweet? 16 to 6 and 1 is your seven stars of Ursa Major, and your seven up, your seven up up soda you didn't ask questions oh i'm a nightmare for everybody because i bring everybody together nightmare very interesting now, i just love it how you put it together jay man like i said i appreciate you coming on here and we're going to continue but as you guys can see numbers are very important such as letters that's how this physical time space reality was created through numbers and letters. That's it. That's why even in the alphabet, it tells you Christ, it spells it out. You know what I mean? Q U Q R S T U Christ. It's telling you like the letters is an actual word. It's the alphabet is an actual phrase telling you how a word begins and becomes into a liquid form. That's what the alphabet is. Yeah. You know what I mean? So so I'll tell you this too. And you just gave me an aha moment and I'm going to end on this. It's probably long enough. There's a lot of stuff. Thank you once again for your time. No, so when you are um, writing a letter, we're writing a letter. A, B, C is one, two, three. And I'm going to blow your minds. I just had an aha moment. Every paper that you turn in, every paper, every exam, every letter you write, We'll have a sum, a number. We'll add up to, to one big number. How many letters have been written? Just <laughs> random rhymes and poems. We never added the number. Well, here's the elephant in the room. You have a being on this earth that is doing that. And it doesn't like you. And it sums up all things quickly. And it gave you a nine millimeter pistol and a Big Mac. I stop there. No, I appreciate it. Stop now. I appreciate it, brother. Once again, you guys, ladies and gentlemen, brothers and sisters watching throughout. Amazing to have this brother on and just share wisdom. Hopefully you can come back on again. I know this was a great buildup. A lot of wisdom was shared. You guys have to rewind us a couple of times just to digest it. But would love to have you back on, Jay, sometime. I, even expounding on this or maybe talking on another topic, but please share like your social media where people can find yeah. you if they, if they want to work with you or yes, I'll put it in the comments as well, but where, where can they reach out to you? Where can they reach out? Oh, this is on um, Instagram. You mean? Yeah. Your Instagram, your Facebook, like what are your pages? So um, my pages are Rawzen 617 on Instagram. I am Rawzen on YouTube, R-A-W space Z-E-N. 
I am J-H-E-R-U-S-S-E-L-L on Facebook and Twitter. And I'm on SoundCloud. I'm also a rapper. Where everything you heard right here, I put in my rhymes. And I encourage everyone to do rhymes. Now, that SoundCloud is called Raw Zen, R-A-W-Z-E-N, if you want to hear my music. Perfect, perfect. So I'm going to put all that in the comment. Again, thank you for sharing your wisdom, Sarah and Troop. This was an amazing podcast. There's a lot that you dropped. I'm going to have to go back and rewind it, but... Again, brother. Oh, me too. No, there's a, there's a lot that was dropped here, but no, when you're really good at what you do, it's not narcissism. When you're good it's at what not. you do, you don't have a script like Raphael. When you don't have a script, you're always going to miss something or catch something you missed and learn from yourself. Exactly. 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 Yeah. <laughs> so again, thank you, brother. We'll go ahead and close this out, uh, nice. but we'll definitely have you back on. We'll speak off camera, but. Brothers and sisters for watching, we want to thank you again for coming to the New Rich, uh, New Energy Podcast. And everybody be blessed, be safe, and when you know better, you do better. Nice. You guys be blessed. <laughs> you guys be blessed. Hold on here. Okay. <laughs>